had to come over to the C64 and see what was in there. There's quite a bit of games, and some of these I definitely, definitely had played. Um, Archon, Steve and I would play this game, and basically you play it like chess, except each one of those pawns has different abilities, and once you get into a square, you fight. It's kind of like the early version of Battle Chess, but it wasn't really using chess pieces. Phoenix is going to explode nearby. The other guy's just a little melee sword dude. Um, yeah, what else? Barbarian. Balderdash. Bruce Lee. Yes, I played that one in my senior year. Got pretty good at it. Now, there's Elite. I actually got Elite for the Commodore 64 first before 1040, but here, I don't know if I remember that. Impossible Mission. That was a beautiful game. Again, I wasn't very good at it. Steve, I think, owned in this one. Let's see what else is in this. Load Runner. Yeah, that was a good one. Mule. Played a lot of Mule. Now, that game is better suited for a couple people. Get four controllers or a keyboard. Um, most of these 64s, I think, might require a keyboard attachment, which isn't a big deal. And just we got spare keyboards around with USB. <gasps> Mail order monsters! Oh my gosh, that's one of the best five dollars I ever spent. Beautiful. Minor 2049er. I think we played this on the ColecoVision. jump out. Bard's Tale, Commodore 64 version, is where I played it first. Of course the graphics are, were lame. You would just kind of click, you had to map your map on your own. Um, but Let's see. Ultima 3 is in here. Exodus, that was the first Commodore game I got. And, Miller, Steve, myself, and maybe John, I can't remember. Spent like 24 hours playing in straight, no sleep. And uh, Miller and I had soccer practice the next day and I had to go to work. And I was literally hallucinating seeing dragons and stuff on the sidewalks. It's crazy. And there you go. Commodore 64. 